Hello boys and girls, it's Mr. Fowler again. I'm glad to see you. So today, in this section, this is the activity section of our lesson. Um, I, wanted to, I wanted to talk about one word. And that one word is rhythm. Everyone say rhythm. It's a weird word. R-H-Y. T H F that's a weird word. Everyone say rhythm. Rhythm. Okay. When we talk about rhythm, we're talking about long and short notes and sometimes rests. So when I say quarter note and I say, oh, that was loud. I'm sorry. When I say quarter note and I say rest and I say other notes that are long and short, that's what we're talking about. We're talking about rhythm. That's only one part of music. How are you guys doing, okay? All right, so what you're gonna need for this is you're gonna need some scissors. I have my scissors. You're gonna need some scrap paper. I just, I was drawing my pictures. You know how I draw my uh, monsters, you know, on the board, I was, pr I was practicing that. So scratch paper, not brand new sheets. You can use old paper, okay? And you're gonna need some type of pencils, okay? And you will need, uh, I have two things. I have a bowl, all right, which I can't use to hit. That's for something else. And I have my pot to hit. Right, okay. The bowl is for something else. I'm not hitting the bowl. Remember I said, don't use anything that if you drop it, it'll break and hit that. Don't do that for rhythm. Don't do that. Last week we had pots and pans, but did you notice I didn't have a bowl like this that could drop and break and crack or glass? Okay, let's talk about the notes that we know. Let's talk about the notes that we know. These are all rhythm notes. And the first one I wanna talk about is we already know about quarter notes. Everyone say quarter. Say quarter note. Can you see that? Okay. And what do we do when we see a quarter note? Now, can we do it this way? Yeah. Can we do it this way? Yeah. There is no such, no such thing as upside down, is there, in music? So, yeah. We can do it this way or that way, or this, this way, you know? Now, what do we do when we see a quarter note? Ah, you're right, one clap. Just one clap, and we're done with the quarter note. Okay, you already knew that. We did that last week. And before, now we have a quarter note rest. Everyone say quarter note rest. Good. Now, what do we do when we see a quarter note rest? Ah, see, you guys are super smart. Thank you. Yes, we put our hands open. There's no noise at all. So it's like this. Rest, right? Rest. So when we see a rest, that's what we do. No sound. Now, today we're going to talk about eighth notes. And eighth notes are just like quarter notes, just like them, but they have a bridge between them. So this makes them short. This bridge right here makes them short. If it didn't have a bridge, it'd just be two quarter notes. But it does have a bridge. So uh, when we play eighth notes, I think I talked about this before in class. When we play eighth notes, there are two of them together. Eight notes, eight notes, eight notes. Try it, ready, go. Eight notes, ready again. Eight notes, try it again. Clapping, try it again. Eight notes, okay, now we're gonna play a little game. And I'm gonna pick up some papers. First, I'm gonna mix them up, mix them up, mix them up. Let me turn them over, mix them up. See, I'm using scrap paper, see? I always use scrap paper. I don't wanna use brand new paper, construction paper. Then like every paper can get two uses that way if I use scrap paper. Okay, now I'm gonna show you a note and then you have to clap it or an arrest, you don't clap it. Okay, ready? Rest, quarter, that's one clap. Eight notes, quarter, eight notes, quarter, rest. <laughs> All right, does everyone know what to do when we uh, see quarter notes, eight notes, and rests. Okay, let's talk about the pot. The same thing that we did last week, 
Okay, I'm going to put the three papers here. Can I do that? Can you guys see these papers? Can you see them? I tried to make it so that we can see them. Let's get this out of the way and this paper out of the way. Okay, out of the way. So here I know I have four of them, right? Uh-oh. Can you see that? All right. We're going to call this one. We're going to call this two. We're going to call this three. And this is four. So we're doing this. Wait a minute. One, two, three, four. Here we go. Order. A, note, A, note, rest. Did I do it right? Did I do it right? Okay, let's mix them up. That's why we don't have numbers. That's why we don't have numbers on these papers, because we can mix them up. We change our own music. We can write our own music by switching these around. Okay. Now, this is number one, two, three, four. Let me try that again. Ready? A note, A note, rest quarter. Did I do it right? Okay, let's mix them up one more time. All right, put that over here. Put this over here. Put this, can I put that? All right, let's try that. One, two, three, four. Ready, and rest quarter, A note, A note. Let's do it again. Rest, quarter, eighth note, eighth note. Ready, go. Rest, quarter, eighth note, eighth note. Did everyone get that? Okay, good. So now we're going to, let's get these out of the way. Let's get these out of the way. We don't need them anymore. What's our magic word for today? What's our music word? Rhythm. Okay, now we need our sheets of paper. This is for your activity. I want you to do this. You don't have to do this right now, but when you turn it in on uh, Seesaw, I want you to do this. Okay, so put the papers together like this, then fold them in half. Can you do that? Fold them in half? Okay, and then I'm gonna cut them in half. Can I cut them? Let's try that. Cut, I only have two pieces of paper. Cut those in half. Uh-huh, now, there we have, how many pieces of paper? We have four. One, two, three, where's three, and four, right? Now cut those in half. Can we do that? Cut that in half. Uh-oh, this is, this is beginning to get a little, bit, a little bit mysterious. What's happening? What's happening? I'm doing it for you. Cut it in half. Okay, now how many pieces? Can anyone tell me how many pieces of paper we have? Eight, you're right. Just like our game, eight. Wait a minute, wait a minute. What's he doing? He's putting the eight pieces of paper down. Wait a minute, can you see this, guys? Okay, and then we're gonna put these others down. Here we go, here, others down. Uh-huh, don't put a number on them. Do not put a number on them, guys. No numbers. Now, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna take my pencil and I'm gonna make a quarter note. Can you make a quarter note? Make it big and fat. Don't make a little quarter note on your paper. You will need to see it. And remember, a quarter note has the oval and then a line. Not too long, not too short. And then on this one, I'm gonna make a rest and you can go zigzag. Did you see that how I made it? That's a quick way. Just make a lightning bolt. Voop, voop, voop. We all know it's a rest. I'm gonna make another quarter note. Make it fat. It's gotta be big and fat. A fat quarter note. One that ate lots of pizza. Okay, now for this one, I'm going to do eighth notes. All right, eighth notes. They look just like quarter notes, right? Two quarter notes, except they have a bridge. Uh-huh. Can you guys see this? Here's my bridge, I gotta make my bridge thicker. Okay, you see that? Eighth notes. And then I'm gonna make another quarter note. How many is that, three? Okay, fat, fat, fat. Not skinny, no one wants a skinny note. Okay, now some more eighth notes. Does it matter if it's upside down or not, boys and girls? Our, when our notes are turned, uh, this way or that way, does it matter? No, it doesn't, except for sideways. Don't make them sideways. Then we can't read it. We don't know what line or space it goes on. 
All right, that's the eighth note. Let's make another rest. Zig, zag, zig. And then let's make another eighth note. Let me do it over here so you can see. Big and fat. Woo! Pizza eating notes. Yeah. I love pizza. Do you like pizza? <laughs> I shouldn't say that. Okay, now boys and girls, look what I have here. I'm, gonna, I'm done with my pencil, guys, and I'm done with the scissors. Put them away. I put them away in my, I see I have a little jar and I just put everything in there. Keeps it nice and neat. Okay, boys and girls. Now what we're gonna do is mix them up, upside down, they're mixed up. Upside down, they're mixed up. Upside down, mixed up. Mix up, mix up, mix up. Okay, now I'm gonna put them in order and I'm gonna see if I can play them. I'm writing my own rhythm with not four, but eight. Eight notes, okay? Eight different rhythm notes. Okay, let's put them upside down so I don't know what they are. This is one, here's two, here's three, here's four. Can you see all of these guys? I hope you can. Five, six, seven, and there's number eight. I hope you can see all of these. All right, so let's turn them over. Oh, eight notes. Eight notes. Eight notes. Quarter, quarter, rest, rest, quarter. Wait a minute. Let me see if I can play that one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Let's see if I can play this. I root to music, boys and girls, just by mixing them up, upside down. Here we go. Eight note, eight note, eight note, quarter, quarter, rest, rest, quarter. Can I do that again? All right, let's do it again. We're starting here, number one. Eight note, eight notes, eight notes, quarter, Quarter, rest, rest, quarter. Did you get that? Okay, that's your activity. That's your activity. What I want you to do is I want you to make eight little pieces of paper and draw a quarter note. How many quarter notes? One, two, three. Three quarter notes. Everyone look at this now. Three quarter notes. Okay, three quarter notes. Put that over there. Um, Two rests, and remember, they're lightning bolts. Two rests, and then three eighth notes. And that equals eight pieces of paper. So what I did is I turned them upside down, remember? I turned them, I didn't know what they were. I turned them upside down. But there's another way you can do it. All right, and this is, this is fun, okay? So mix them up, get all your papers together, your eight papers, mix them up, you know what, I'm gonna use my big bowl here. I'm gonna use a big pot. Can I do that? I put all the papers in here, and I mix them up. Okay, I'm gonna close my eyes. Watch this, I'm gonna put my hat over my eyes. Mix them up. Mix them up. All right, mix them up. Okay, now I'm gonna get, without, my, without looking, okay, without looking, I'm gonna put one here. And then one here, where's the other one? Okay, and then one here, and then one here. So, pretty soon, boys and girls, you'll have all eight on the table. I have to use my eyes for this because I'm gonna, my table and my camera are messed up. Okay, so here we are. And then I just turn them over. They're already mixed up. Oh my goodness, this is way different. Way different. Oh my goodness. Starts with a rest? Let me try this. Where's my spoon? Can you, can you guys try something for me? Can you clap this with me? Can you clap this one with me if you can see it? I hope the camera can see it. Clap this one, okay? Let's try it. Rest, A note, A note, rest. Quarter, 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 eight note. That's your assignment, boys and girls. So find eight pieces of paper, 
and write a note on them. And you can write three eighth notes. One, two, three. Three quarter notes. One, two, three. And two quarter note rests. Rest and rest. Do you remember how to make these? Just make a lightning bolt, okay? Now, your assignment is, boys and girls, to get your eight piece, eight notes, mix them up, and play them. Play them on a pot or a pan with a spoon. Can you do that? I want you to videotape yourselves and put that on Seesaw. Can you do that? Man, that would make me happy. All right. Thank you, boys and girls. Thank you very much.